uh, we got home earlier and um, before we open up the uh, garage that just like this um, we noticed that one of our light to the uh, pilot is out like that this one is out and the one over here on the driver's side is on and we, we tried it and um, found out that the uh, high beam is working but the low beam is not so um, we went to the auto uh, parts store and bought some lights so we're going to change this one in a minute okay see as you can see there's only one light that is working okay okay so uh, we went and bought the uh, uh, this brand is called Sylvania and the uh, size is the uh, 900 9003 h4 and this is uh, the um, it's called the ultra bright so uh, it's blue on the outside and gold on the top here so um, I will put this in in a minute okay so uh, once you get the hood open, all you need to do is take this um, uh, plug right here out. Okay, take that out and put it, uh, move it out of the way. And then you have to uh, move this um, this plastic casing here. This casing here is to protect uh, dirt and uh, water from getting inside your um, this thing here. It's to protect the uh, dirt and water to from getting inside to your uh, to your light and uh, you see this little all you need to do is push it down and release and there you go you got your light take the light out it's just a matter of seconds so once you uh, got that out just set it aside and put your new one in. So what you need to do is take your gloves off or you leave them on, but I'm going to take mine off and uh, see if I can get this out. Okay. And remember not to touch the bulb, okay? Only use your hand and touch this metal part only, not the bowl. So, um, okay. And then just insert, insert it just like you uh, take it out before. Yeah. Okay, so, yeah, just make sure it's like, best way to do it is, you make sure that you got three prongs right here, so make sure this one is on the top, okay? And these are on the sides, so you just put it straight in. Like that. Once you get it in like that, just... Just make sure you put the... The spring lock back on. Like that. Okay. Okay, so make sure the three prong put this one on top and uh, these two are on the side, just like that, right back in there. Okay, so move the spring lock and uh, just there, it's in there. Just put the spring right back on there and push it under there to lock and there you go that's all done and then what you need to do is put this right back on oh no not yet don't put that back on yet you need to put these uh, this rubber thing back on there to protect it first okay and should snap it right back on easily like that nice and easy 
and then bam there you go nice and tight we're good and then since we bought two you know we'll do the other side again so everybody can uh, uh, see how it's done again okay this one's a little bit tight the one on the um, the one on the um, driver's side is a little bit tight because of the air filter here so um, it's gonna be a little bit hard for you guys to see this but since you guys already seen the first one this is just the second one so uh, go ahead and take the plug out just move it to the side and then move the plastic casing or cover here the dust cover or water cover so we'll go ahead and move that Okay, so you got the got the rubber casing that protects the uh, water and dust, and put it aside, and then just release the spring. You're not gonna be able to see it because of the air filter, but release the spring like the other side, Bottom. and then. Pull the light out. There you go. You got the light. The old one. And now it's time to put the new one in. So make sure don't touch the bulb. But just the metal part. And make sure the one prong here is on top. Just like that. Put it in like that. Okay. So. A little bit tight. You guys are not going to be able to see this one. Because of that. But just slide that in. Okay, so I think we're good. And here's the here's the spring that locks it up. And there you go, it's all locked in place like that. And all you need to do is just put the rubber casing back on, and uh, we should be good. So let me go ahead and put that back on. Okay, I think we're good. Nice and aligned. Once it's aligned, let's go ahead and put your plug back on. Plug is over here. And uh, okay, I think we're good. Let's give it a try. Okay, let's see if they work. Okay. All right, this one we just replaced, and the right one was the uh, the passenger side was the one that was out. So as you can see, everything is working perfectly right here, both sides, and that only took like maybe about five minutes. Anybody can do it, you know. So hopefully this uh, video helps everybody out. Thank you for watching and uh, tune in for next time.